as a tropical storm. Now let's talk about exactly how much wind you need to move certain objects around. We start out with this formula. I'm not going to get into the formula, but the things you need to know about that particular object is its weight and its area. So let's start out with something small like a maple leaf. Well, that's pretty small and it has a pretty small coverage area. So you only need three miles of wind to three miles an hour of wind speeds to blow away a maple leaf. But once you get into those trash cans that we keep outside our homes, that's a little heavier it has a more of a coverage area you need around 28 miles an hour wind speeds to move a trash can around which we were well beyond that today so a lot of you guys if you're just now getting home from work you might want to go check on your trash can it might be down the street now thinking about the average person assuming they weigh around 175 pounds that's a larger coverage area a larger mass now you're looking at about 67 mile per hour winds that's a, another that's a stronger tropical storm strength wind that can knock a person over now getting into a car 90 mile per hour wind speeds can move a car sideways that's about a strong category one hurricane now thankfully we haven't gotten that high with wind speeds today but we are going to talk about the night ahead coming up in my full forecast so make sure you stick around